In this video, you will learn how to use the elapsed time calculator in EMS Smart, which will help you to thoroughly analyze your current performance and achieve cooperative targets. This tool will enable you to measure your performance in elapsed days on the item level, on the receptacle dispatch and consignment level, and between item and receptacle events. In the horizontal toolbar of Smart, Within Elapsed Time Calculations, choose Elapsed Time Calculator from the drop-down list. You will find three sections, Configuration, Reports, and Job Status. Before running the generation of a report, we need to set up several parameters under the section Configuration. Pay attention to the little eye symbols. They provide useful information about the setting of each parameter. First, we need to define what the From and To events are. Let's choose from EMA to EMC. Then we need to set up the direction. As origin refers to your outbound items, while as destination refers to your inbound flow. Next, we need to choose one or more partners from the drop-down list. To do so, type country name or operator code. If we decide to include all partners, then this section should remain blank. Regarding the period, we can choose one month or the last one up to 45 days. If you choose the daily one, please be aware that the data may be not yet complete. The last setting that must be made is whether to have the results displayed cumulatively or non-cumulatively. Here, select yes or no accordingly. Now we are ready to create the report by clicking the button Generate. The system will create the report in a few minutes if the volume of data is relatively low. Larger requests, on the other hand, will take a bit longer to generate. When your report is ready, you will receive an email with the report as an attachment. At the same time, the report will appear on the top of the list under the section Report. You can follow the status of the report production under the section Job Status. The state Running means the report is under creation, while succeeded means the job is done. The page is self-refreshing and therefore please do not click on generate multiple times. You cannot generate a new report with different parameters while the previous job is in the running status. Additionally, a report with the same parameters cannot be produced twice on the same day. You will be notified of this before confirming the report generation. In case you miss this notification, you will also be notified with a pop-up message when you request this action later on. On the right side, you will find a filter, which can be useful in case you are looking for a specific report that was generated in the past. This will save time in running the same report twice. You can also download the list of all reports that have been generated in this section. All reports created by you and other users from your organization will be listed under the section Report. For each report, by right-clicking, you can download the report, which you also received by email, or download a flat file that corresponds to that report. The flat file will include all item or receptacle IDs and relevant data on which the report is created. You can also download both the report and flat file as a zip file or discard this report together with the flat file. All these reports will help you to investigate your end-to-end -end pipeline and check performance of each leg. Furthermore, it will enable you to evaluate performance of individual segments of each leg to identify weak points. Please enjoy using this tool to analyze your EMS performance.